separates us from the others, uh, we, do, we do the cooking process the old school way. It's, um, it's, it's a labor of love, so there's lots of hard work and, and sweat that goes into it. Uh, we don't use machines, it's offset cookers, uh, it's man, meat, and fire. The way we're doing it here is, really hasn't changed since the 20s. It's a uh, post oak. Post oak and low and slow and salt and pepper. The combination of that pepper, that grease, and that good smoke combines to build up that bark. This is gonna be probably about six people. Everyone should order this. If you come to Texas, you come to Texas for a beef rib and brisket. And that's what we do best. I came here to eat beef ribs and pulled pork. I'm off, I'm off school, I'm on break, so I thought I'd treat myself. You know, if I had a punch with the jam, so I'm good. So it's gonna get a good old meal, you know? mustard, salt, and pepper on top of this because it is so packed with flavor. Best. Well, I'll tell you, this is my first time here, but I have to say that uh, I was pretty impressed. My family's originally from Lockhart, Texas. Uh, we opened a barbecue restaurant there in 1932. My brother and I set out to open up the restaurant. Uh, he didn't want to name it after me, and I sure as heck didn't want to name it after him. So we settled on my dad's name. My dad loves loves uh, you know having the having a restaurant named after himself. Um, he's a good guy. He's a hardworking guy, and uh, it's a way for, for us to pay our respects to him. And we're done.